Hey everyone, welcome to Comic Artist Pro Secrets again. It's uh, May the 4th, Star Wars Day, and uh, I just went on the Star Tours, updated Star Tours ride. This is what I need. I need a blinged out Star Wars hat. This is rad. Could I wear this? Could, could I get away with that? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, yeah, so the, the Star Tours ride is uh, actually, oh, look at this. That is, that's super blinged out. What do I like better? Do I like this bling bling? Or do I like that bling bling? I don't know, I think they're both for girls. Not sure. So the Star Tours ride is just an updated version of uh, the classic ride, Star Tours ride that they had in the 1990s. Um, except this time, of course, they've added horrendous poisonous elements from The Last Jedi. Uh, Kylo Ren is in it in the beginning. C-3PO puts you on a ship, you're supposed to go on a tour, and uh, the pilot doesn't get on. C-3PO is the guy flying you around, which is the last thing you want. Now, uh, it's pretty cool. They have a, a C-3PO uh, animatronic robot who is talking to you the whole time in front of a 3D screen. Um, Finn shows up and puts in, a, puts in an effort as a performance. Oh, look at this Ewok backpack. Hello. Hey guys, we are in the uh, Star Wars, uh, Star Tours gift shop right now at, uh, at Disney World, in case you're just joining us. Um, and basically, yeah, you see Finn, you see Poe. How long is learning? And you do the salt, uh, the salt mines and, and all that stuff. Uh, it's, you know, look, it made me, it made me nauseous. No Rose Tico. Unfortunately, there was no Rose Tico, guys. I was, I was counting on Rose Tico to show up. She let me down. I am looking for Rose Tico merchandise now. Uh, this is the terrible robot that uh, talks to you most of the time. Uh, yeah, does not look like a Star Wars character at all. Let's see, over here, we've got... I'm looking for exclusives, you know? It's like, what, what can I get here that I can't get anywhere else? Oh my God. We're doing this my way, oh boy. Yeah, your way means bankruptcy. Your way means Disney solvency. Your way means a steady decline, downwards. Downwards. Your way means disgrace. What is this, a remote control mouse droid? That's kind of cool. Um, here we have the uh, Millennial Falcon, the new Millennial Falcon that I did review. Uh, it is in my garbage can right now. Um, it, it doesn't work with the, um, does not work with the Force Link 2.0. Well, maybe it does now. I don't know. I'm not sure. Got a nice set of Soilo toys. I have to say, I mean, you know, the detail on these is absolutely beautiful. I mean, these should be garbage tier, but they're not. I mean, they really are good. They really are pretty good. Um, infinite number of depressed, unemployed Luke Skywalker without a lightsaber. He's got no lightsaber, none. He's got no weapon. He's like, strike me down, please. That's the thing. He's supposed to be like Obi-Wan Kenobi. He should have said, strike me down, and I'll become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. But no, he's just like, strike me down, please. I'm in my bathrobe. I got nothing going on. And it is sad. It is. Got Finn. Finn, again, did make an appearance uh, in the um, uh, in the Star Tours ride. And he did a very good job. So did Poe. Uh, they all had a, they had smirks on their faces. Like they knew what they were doing was silly. Everyone, cheer for Chloe. Where's my studio audience when I need them? Um, yeah, these hats, I did, this was a bridge too far. Uh, I didn't get this, this hat, I did get one of these though. Couldn't do that. This is the miniature Millennial Falcon here. I, I, I honestly, I don't know why you would get this uh, instead of the bigger one. I don't know what it does. It doesn't fit any action figures. All right, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something good here. You guys tell me if you see something that I should get. Uh, I'm not getting any of this. No dorbs. None of this. This is an outrage. What is this? What is this? 
that's Han Solo. He shot first. Look at the look on his face. Oh my God. Look at Luke Skywalker. He looks like he should be slurping Udon noodles. Oh, it's awful. It's just awful. What are they doing to my beloved franchise? Oh, this is cool. I might be getting one of these. Yeah, big Yoda puppet. Is it a puppet? No, it's just a figure. It's not a puppet. I might, I'm gonna get one of those, I think, guys. You let me know. Uh, let's see. I know a lot of you are saying, stop it, don't support Disney. No, you have to. Oh, this is the good stuff behind the counter here. Hold on a second. We've got Legos galore. Yeah, really nice. Have you built any of these? Where? People are saying the TIE footage is really good. I'm live stream YouTube right now. You want to say hi to Star Wars fans? Say hello to Star Wars fans. Oh, nice. Okay, we might, I don't know. They're asking me to build Legos. It just takes so long. I don't know how to make a Lego building Star Wars video, but I might do it eventually. A lot of people do a, as progress goes. Yeah. I could do it sped up. I could do it sped up. Maybe. Really? Oh my gosh. Do you have anything ex exclusive to the store that I can only get here? As far as toys, to like action figures, Hasbro stuff? Launch bay. Where's that? Out. Okay. All right. Very cool. Thanks. We'll head over there. Thanks a lot, man. You too. Oh my God! Look at this. It's a miserable Darth Vader. Do you guys have this? Look at him. He's like, what have I done with my life? This looks like me. This straight up looks like me. Colton, my 228 viewers right now wanted to say thank you and hello. So, <laughs> good night, everyone. All right, let's go over here and let's take a look. Uh, ooh. Yeah, I'm a sucker for Job of the Hut, but I, I don't know. I don't know if that's for me. All right, there's nothing here. We're going to head over to uh, the launch bay, I think you said. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Yeah, I have to say, you know, the ride made me physically ill. Um, but, you know, it was fun, and, and they did a good job of... Uh, it's brand new. I, I was afraid when I got on it that it was going to be uh, the same ride that I went on um, when I was in Disney California which was old, I mean, it, it was the old characters. Uh, no, this had the new unappealing characters. Um, and, you know, it was fun. Here we have that ad ad again. Yeah, he actually shoots. Somebody said the ad ad is limp wristed. I, I didn't take notice of that until now. Uh, it is true. Uh, people are telling me to steal a child's cotton candy. I don't think I'll be doing that. Oh, he's shooting, the ad ad is shooting. I don't know if you can hear that. It's actually a really nice night. Oh, he's got, he's got, yeah, he's red. I mean, that is nice. It looks good from this angle, but when you're on the other side of it, it's propped up with like, I don't know, steel uh, cylinders. It's, it just looks weird. Yeah. All right, so we gotta find Let's see, we gotta find the launch bay. They, I wasn't listening to him when he told me where it was. You guys probably were. There is no Rose Tico roller coaster. There really should be. Did I go down this way? And you know, I, I, um, I asked a bunch of, well, I looked up on, online, I saw that there was like a dancing Darth Vader show. I really wanted to show you guys Darth Vader dancing. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Hey, guys, where's the where's the launch bay 
Um, if you have to make this here across the Chinese theatre, you'll go through an archway that says Hollywood Studios. Excellent. Okay, thank you. All right, let's go. Yeah, we'll find it. No, I'm not seeing Stormtroopers. I really expected to see a lot more of a Star Wars presence here. It really is more evidence that Star Wars is dead uh, and dying and people just don't care anymore. They just don't care. I mean, they're, they're doing it. You would think that a ride like that on May the 4th would be impossible to get on, but I, they told me it was a 45 minute wait. I might have waited 15 minutes. I didn't wait very long. Do I want to get a beer? I shouldn't drink in front of you guys. Yeah, your Uncle Ethan doesn't endorse alcohol consumption. It's just not good for the kids. And this is a family-friendly channel. Yeah. Launch Bay, down this way? Launch Bay, straight down that way. Just keep going straight. Okay, we will. Go straight, everyone. That's good advice. It's good advice. All right, what do we got here? We got the commissary. So if I wanted to get a turkey leg or something, I'll bet I could get one in there. I know they have beers. I want a big, huge, gigantic beer right now, so bad. Uh, something light, maybe a Yingling. Uh, maybe a Stella Artois. We'll see. I might wait until I get back to my hotel to do that. Um, the whole day, the whole, uh, you know, Jeremy from Geeks and Gamers has been calling me and, and uh, texting me. Uh, he is kind of local. He's about... Uh, what did he say? Uh, 90 minutes away? He said he was a distance away. Um, but he is going to come down uh, and spend a little time. We're going to probably do a joint uh, Star Wars live stream with Jimmy Kimmel. Probably not Jimmy Kimmel. And we'll do that, you know, we'll do that tomorrow night. I've got a bunch of signings to do uh, in my alternate job as world famous comic book professional. Uh, one of the greatest comic book professionals, well known, beloved uh, in the world. That's my other job. That's my other job. Uh, this is this is my main job. My main job is uh, cracking on Star Wars for you guys. I take it very seriously. Now he said, just keep going straight, and here we go. We end up in this kind of roundabout area here. Oh, there's the Hollywood Studios gate that they talked about. You can see it. Can I get this to blow up? Yeah, you can see it over there. So that's where we're headed. Yeah, so much trash. So much trash at Disney. Uh, this is meant to look like the Chinese theater. Uh, it is racist. This is uh, cultural appropriation right here. So yeah, we are pointing the Rose Tico finger of scorn at the cultural appropriation. The, oh look, maybe so, uh, there's a kid who cares about Star Wars over there. There's one kid who cares about Star Wars. That's reassuring. Maybe there's some life in Star Wars yet. Who knows? Can't be sure. Can't be sure. Every now and then you see a little red lightsaber swinging around. And you're just like, hey, uh, maybe Star Wars isn't quite dead. And then you really take a look. You realize that you're, you know, you're missing the forest for the trees. And yeah. Oh, stormtroopers. Here we go. This is what we came for. Stormtroopers, hey, can you say Comic Artist Pro Secrets? What? I heard, I'd always heard Stormtroopers were nice guys. That ass though. All right, let's keep going. <laughs> well, at least we saw some Stormtroopers. Star Wars is, is still dead and dying though. Um, just those two. They refuse to say hi to you guys, the fans. They were very rude. Very rude for uh, the fascist militant arm of uh, the Empire. I just expected more from them. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Yeah, all right. They were right. They sent us to the right spot. Look at all these strollers. If I went into like a stroller stealing business, I'd do really good right here. I could steal these strollers, refurbish them, and, um, and sell them all at uh, an up cost. Wait a second. This is a theater. 
What do we do here? Character experience. Hi. What character is in here to be experienced? Can I film them if I go in? Okay. How long is the wait? Uh. Oh my God. It's too long. I can't. I can't make it. I mean, I want to meet BB-8. I've wanted to meet BB-8 my whole life. Uh, I don't think I can meet BB-8 for for 25 minutes. Chewbacca, the same. Kylo Ren. I don't know. We'll see. Let's go into the souvenir store. This is launch big. Is this the souvenirs right over here? Okay. So we're going to go in here. We're going to see if we can get anything exclusive that we can bring home and throw in my garbage can at home because, you know. Oh, it's nice Darth Vader. And you can see the difference between James and Boba Fett. This, oh my God, look, it's a double telescoping Darth Vader action figure, but it's big. Oops, what I do? Yeah, that's big. What do you guys think of that? Double telescoping. It's worth like $75,000 from what I understand. And here we have uh, Darth Vader's original costume. This is his costume from the movie. Uh, if you would like to purchase it, it is $3,000. I think. I don't know. Is that what that says? Please see... Wait. Please see a cast member for assistance. Uh, the following specialty costume items are non-refundable. Okay, so uh, you need to have $3,000 in cash. Of course, your Uncle Ethan never leaves home without less than $6,000 in cash. And, uh, yeah, this is, the, this is what I need to wear around the house. This is what I need to wear around the house. Yeah, good stuff. All right, oh, so here's the helmet without the lid, but the lid is over here. So you, I mean, one assumes that for $3,000, you do get that piece and that piece as well. That looks like it could fit my head. If you look at, here's my hand. Yeah, this is enormous. Uh, here's the thing. The difference between me and Ryan Johnson is my head is shaped like an oval and his head is a perfect circle. So if Ryan Johnson put his head in this helmet, you'd only see his mouth right here and his chin. Perfect circle right here. He can't dress like Darth Vader, I can. Oh, here we have like, oh wow. Can we bring home some uh, vino? A little wine? No Pinot Noir? Chardonnay, we don't need that. Uh, Skywalker Rose. Santa. Olive oil. Yeah, I mean, I would, I'm, I might do a little Pinot Noir, but, you know, I don't know. I don't know. We need a Cabernet. We need a Cab. Um, here's all the books that you guys told me that I should read that used to be uh, EU, uh, but now these these are not um, these are not canon any longer. These are no longer canon. Um, yeah. Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. I would wear this. I would wear this. Have a great day. Guys, super chat me three thousand dollars, and we'll buy, we'll buy the Darth Vader costume and throw it in my garbage can. Probably not, right? Clothing line. Here's a nice clothing line. Um, yeah. People are asking me to put on these shirts. I will. I mean, this is very nice. I don't know, I'm not seeing what I want though. I want uh, action figures. Oh, look here, here we have like big models, statues. Oh my God. Whoa. It's a Hot Toys Princess Leia or Sideshow. Is it Sideshow? 
Hot Toys. Uh, that's pretty nice. Console and Carbonite. Good C3PO. Leia's my favorite details for the face. Really? Just because of the Look at the eyes. Of the eyes. Yeah, like yeah. The eyes, the lips, all of those facial features just pop up. Yeah, it really does look good. Now, just for how cool it is. We've got a bunch of stormtroopers the over there, too. Oh, look at the jaw walks. Because, like, you see all the different stuff that pops out on R2. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm live streaming with a bunch of uh, Star Wars fans. You want to say hello? Say, hey, Comic Artist Pro Secrets. How's it going? All right. <laughs> nice to meet you all. So what do you recommend? you like the droids? What about this Yoda up here? Yoda? Yoda's one of the ones that's the most customizable. I'll show you. Yeah, look at his little eyes. They're closed. So he must... Yoda, you get so many options. Yoda is the man of many options. With his little three fingers. <laughs> oh. You can go eyes oh, I got it, I got it. <laughs> okay. You can go eyes closed, you can go eyes open. Whoa. He's got his stand, he's got all his hands, he's got the necklace, he's got the cane. That was a good looking toy. You can make the rocks float, you can make them sit down. Um we're oh Darth Vader. Now hold on a second. We might we might be talking about getting a Darth Vader. There's a uh, Ray uh, mini bust. I don't know why you need to comment on her body like that, Noah. Mini bust, <laughs> do you? I don't think you know, so. Well, we say the same thing about Kylo Ren. Oh well, yeah, no comment there. <laughs> uh, we Darth all saw the Last Jedi together. Yeah. Oh my God. What did you think of the Last Jedi? Different character. I was refreshed to see that we're able to take it to new places after all these years. I'm excited to see what new creators can do in that sandbox. Well, they can they can take it straight into the garbage can too, though. I mean, that's kind of well, because that's, that's the idea is that we're starting to get to this place where we get to start to play with characters who aren't Skywalkers. Yeah. So we get to do things like a solo story or a Rogue One. The more that we get to see stories like that play in this intergalactic universe, I am beyond excited for outside of this traditional narrative. You're the man. Give me a pound. Boom. All right. Thank you very much. Now this is, uh, ooh, look at that, Boba Fett. So we don't have a Rose Tico. That is our one complaint here. No, uh, yeah, I'm not getting on fire, don't worry. You got two, you got a Django Fett, you got a Boba Fett. And over here you got helmets. Oh, excuse me. I'm walking, I'm trying to walk by the entrance and people are coming in and out. These, these are awesome right here. I don't think anybody's gonna disagree. This one in particular. This one less so. And then we have a full-fledged stormtrooper. This is only nine grand. Um, I wonder if the they have like local stormtrooper troops. Like you can join a stormtrooper club. And these guys all have costumes. They all walk around like the guys that we saw outside. And I wonder if they paid nine thousand dollars for their suit, or if like those are fake and this one's real. That is the question. Is that the real deal? I mean, look at that. They've got their black and white guns that look stupid. Yeah. So anyone who wants to super chat me $9,000, I'll walk out of here dressed like a stormtrooper. That's up to you guys. That's up to you guys. Um, yeah, we've got some wooden. Oh, these are those little metal kits that you can build. I tried to buy my son one of those. He didn't. He said thank you. He didn't build it, though. He didn't build it. Um, people are looking at me strange because I am talking to myself. That's okay. I know that we all know the truth, you know. But I'm talking to you guys. Oh, look. Okay, so we're getting close to the kinds of things I want. Somebody asked me if I wanted to build these kind of uh, snap together models, uh, and they look like this. I mean, they're okay. They're okay. I'm not. I'm not too thrilled. Oh, here we go. Okay, so I think. What is this? Is this a Disney exclusive? What is that? I can't believe it. I came here to buy things and there's nothing I want. Here's a droid gift pack though. Let me, let me look at this. I mean, that's pretty good. 
I probably drop kick the BB-8 out the window, to be honest with you, but I keep the other two. It's a glow-in-the-dark BB-8. Oh, look, look, his eyes are closed. Oh, Yoda. <laughs> <sighs> no, for real, he's he's alive. He's real. He goes back to sleep like me. He talks for a little while and then he goes back to sleep. That is so cute. Who said it's creepy? It's not creepy. It's adorable. One more time. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh, look at him. He wants his baba. Like, he, he wants his baba. You want your baba? You want to go back to sleep? Oh, how much is he? Uh, $32.99. He looks drunk. Uh, I don't know. Rose Tico on the bottom shelf. There's no Rose Tico. What's down here? Whoa. I don't see any Rose Tico at all. None. Do we have a Lego Rose Tico? Dude, look at this. These are build your own droids. You've got legs here. Look, here's somebody who built a C-3PO. Looks perfect. Nice. I don't know, guys. Uh, there is absolutely zero, zero Rose Tico in this place. There's no Rose Tico. None. I don't even know what to say. Makes me feel like having a drink. Quite frankly. Let's drink away the lack of Tico. Hello. Yeah, you got to, right? You yeah, we're, we were thinking about it. You got to do it. Is that the, the spicy one or the sweet one? It's Pinot Noir. It's kind of sweet. No, there's two of them. There's two Pinot Noirs. Yeah. There is? There's a spicy one on the bottom, and then there's a sweeter one on top. Are you sure? Yeah. So if you read the description, we were looking I, at the top one, but then we saw the bottom. The, you got the spicy one. This is the spicy Full one? Spicy. Marin County. Well, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. I didn't know there was more than one Pino Noir over there, but I, I will try this. I'm disappointed that there's no Cabernet. That is my that is my wine of choice. They may have it, just not... Not here. Not here. All right. Well, it's okay. I wonder if they'll let you drink this walking around. Probably not. Straight straight out of the... Yeah, that's that's the thing, isn't it? You need to, you need a corkscrew. Yeah, just walk around, drinking from a bottle of Skywalker uh, wine. The line is long. A lot of people found what they wanted here. I didn't find what I wanted. I didn't find what I wanted, guys. A lot of people are saying this is very classy to, to buy a Skywalker wine, a Pinot Noir, and drink it straight from the bottle as you walk around the children's theme park. A lot of people are mistaking that for classy. It is a, it is a sad day. Look, all of that, no Rose Tico. No representation. At all. Uh, somebody is suggesting that I put this in a paper bag and drink from it. Uh... That's a good idea. I think that's even more classy. You don't want to show off what you are, uh, what you're drinking. You don't need to show it off. Your label. Brown paper bag it. Over here, you can get a Darth Vader bust. I'm live streaming to 652 people right now. So. <laughs> People are turning around and looking at me like I'm nuts. That's okay, that's kinda am, you know. Oh look, there's more over there. There's like, there are more options up on the, uh, I think they're all the same though. Do you see the regular Pinot Noir up there? 
Is it the the two dark blues and the one with the white edge on it? I might I might trade this in. I might trade this in. Yeah. Uh, here's the other option: buying this Darth Vader bus, wearing it, and drinking this out of a paper bag, walking around Disney World. You know, it's just something to think about. It's your vacation. You can do whatever you want to do. Tomorrow I have to work. Tomorrow I have to work. How much is that Darth Vader? Only $1,100. If anybody wants to super chat me, $1,100. Uh, I will walk around wearing a Darth Vader helmet. All right. I'm going to have to pay cash for this. So you guys don't see my credit card. I will get docs. Definitely Does anybody want a Chewy is my co-pilot button? Just let me know. Uh, copies of The Last Jedi for $40. It's reasonably priced. Reasonable. I don't see why not. Hi. Could I trade this in actually for the sweeter Pinot Noir? The one with the white label? The, the white stripe around it right there? The other one next to it. Boom. Is that a Pinot Noir? It's not, is it? It's not a Pinot Noir. I knew it. You know what? I'll take it anyway. I want that one instead. I just like it. Because I don't care. I'm not I'm not getting what I want, so. Alright, that's yeah. And this one, I'm sorry. I don't think I want that one. I want that one instead. What's up? Oh, I understand that. But somebody told me there was a difference. There were two different kinds of pinos. There are. Somebody was right and I was wrong. Yeah. I'm getting educated here. Sami Yai. All right, that's what I want then. That's what I, I'm sorry to be so indecisive. I'm worse at home. All right, let's get the money. With one hand, I got to do this with one hand. I can't believe you guys are watching this. It's like $100, it's not $39. Oh, $40 for the blue race. Sure. Don't show these people, though. There you go. I look very young. You guys, I look very, very young. I just got carded. Some of you are saying I actually look like an old man, but you're wrong. You are wrong. I like to... I got carded. Well, I mean, you know. But is that the same style? Yeah. You guys are like, you sound so young, and then we see your face, and you look like an old man. Well, most people, most normal people see my face and think I'm like 16. So, you know. Thank you very much. Gotta do everything with one hand. It's just like everything else in life. I, guys, I haven't had a drink at all. I'm just, I, I wanna buy a good souvenir. A lot of you are saying that you get carded all the time and that you're 45. How much is it? 95? Okay, good. 105. Okay, I gotta get another bill out. There we go. And I need to sign this. Oh, you, oh, they prevent you from walking around with it. What do I have to do? I fill this out? Just your guest. Are you kidding me? Oh, I don't know if I can do this. You're going to send this to my house back in New Jersey? In front? Yeah, we sent it to the front of the park. Oh, got it. Okay, no problem. 
I was like, that's amazing service, but I would just walk it out of here. Again, I got to move my camera to the side, so I am not doxxed. So as long as it's before that, we are all good. I live in just constant fear of being doxxed. You guys can look at these. We're live streaming right oh, now. Fun. We've got 717 people watching wow. me buy Star Wars wine. That's very exciting. It is. Sometimes when I'm writing my address down, I say it aloud. I shouldn't do that right now. Yeah. Uh, departure date, room number. So you're just going to ship this up front. I can pick it up at the, where? At guest services? Oh, cool. Because you are picking up alcohol, you'll have to exit the park and go to the outside package pickup window, but it's a little attached to the thing. Oh, okay. So through the turnstiles, enter your room. Can do. All right, so what do I get? A receipt? Yeah. We'll give you your copy of this green sheet as well. And that's what you'll So, guys, you can't walk around with a bottle of wine and drink it in the park. Brittany says no. No, alcohol is all good. We have alcohol everywhere, but it's the glass is the issue. So if you if you like break the glass, that could lead to some uh, not so safe situations. So, I hear you. It's true. Excellent. Excellent. It's it's a small world after all. Yeah. Flying off the shelves. So how'd you guys feel about The Last Jedi? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Oh, oh, mixed reviews. All right, mixed reviews. No, you don't. Didn't they brag about using real effects in that movie? Yeah. It is what it is. But I was also one of the few people who was like, yeah, Force Awakens. Well, we all did that. We all liked The Force Awakens. They tricked us. They tricked us. We thought that Han Solo was coming back for good. And it was very sad. Yeah. We hope so. You think so? Oh, you think so? Okay. So we have some advanced excitement about Donald Glover and Solo, a Star Wars story. Uh, very, uh, very excited. Yeah. Okay. All right. I said that. I made a whole video saying that uh, Donald Glover was going to save the movie. I'm positive that that's going to happen. I'm almost, I'm almost certain that's going to happen. What else do I need to do? Awesomeness. Anybody want this? Up here? Or no? No? Okay. A lot of people are in love with you ladies. Just to let you know. Yeah. Getting a lot of positive reviews. <laughs> oh my god. A lot of people are saying that I should ask for a... S no, I'm not going to do that. I just killed the vibe with this close-up. This one? Come on now. Get a fun pick with Rose Tico. Rose Tico is not in the park that I know of. We can ask. We can ask. Is really? So we can go see Rose Tico's costume or at least a replica thereof, uh, if you'd like to. I mean, it's not, you know, it's not that important. If she's not in it, I don't really care. All right, so this is good? Cool? All right, done. Thank you very much, guys. All right, we're heading out. It's now dark outside. We did not. People are saying, buy that costume. You guys have super chatted me $18. How am I going to spend $9,000? I come home, Andrea chops my head off.
that's the way it is. You gotta be careful about things like that. Yeah, up here, look. How wonderful. Look at Luke Skywalker up there. Like that poster really does make you think that something significant is going to happen in that movie. And it doesn't, it doesn't. Nothing happens. Uh, another very exciting poster. Um, nothing happens. It's humiliation for everyone involved. Beautiful night here in Orlando, Florida. Walking around, looking at uh, this, all these kids shows that are on TV and they're on my TV all the time. I don't get to watch normal things anymore because I have a two-year-old daughter. I haven't seen an R-rated movie in uh, two years. And that is because I have, this is always on my TV or Sesame Street. Yeah. And that's the reality of it, guys. That is the truth. Here's the Little Mermaid. And now, your Uncle Ethan, who has not had one single thing to drink or eat all day, is going to try to find his way towards something edible and drinkable. Oh my god! Oh my god! Dun dun dun! Dun 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 dun! dun. Yeah. All right, now we're talking. Okay. Hi. How you doing? Good. What? This is turning out to be a terrible day. There's no Rose Tico. The bar is closed. I'm, I just bought a hundred dollar bottle of Luke Skywalker wine that they won't let me walk around drinking straight from the bottle. I, I'm, I'm live streaming to 750 people right now. So, okay, yeah. Well, I can point you in the direction of the next bar. Really? Yes, oh, yeah. That's a door yeah. song. <laughs> Show me the way. Okay. Thank you very much. I will. I will. Yeah, we're, you know, we're getting help from some of the um, best people at Disney World here. I'm sure they're all Comic Artist Pro Secrets fans, uh, if not Star Wars uh, haters. And they want to help me to uh, have a drink, if at all possible. Look at this. Oh, by the way, if you know, to make this kind of a, a four dimensional experience for you, uh, the sky, the air just smells like popcorn. It's exactly what you hope Disney World is going to be like. Oh, here's the bar. Is this the bar that they were talking about? It's got to be. That's got to be the bar. But how do I get in? Let's find out. Specialty cocktails, wine by the glass, not by the bottle. That is a that is a problem. Is this the line right here? Okay. All right. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Oh, we could sit down and drink. I don't know. Oh. So we don't have an option. We we've got to order a drink here. I I'd been here earlier. This is all what I did. Let's see what kind of, uh, well, they have a little gray goose. That's good. That is the vodka of choice. You don't want Tito's. You don't want Tito's. I don't know. Rose red wine. A lot of people saying that I'm an alcoholic and these people are wrong. These people are wrong. Tito's. I, Tito's. All right, so again, we've got we've got the Disney music in the air. We've got the smell of uh, popcorn. Uh, we've got bars that are all closing down. They're trying to. I think they're trying to funnel people out of the park. Could be wrong. A Rose Tito's. That's an actually interesting drink. Can we get a Rose Tito's? Uh, let's see. Yeah. How can we do that? Like, how can we make a Rose Tito's? little red wine and and vodka that would be horrible that'd be horrible i don't know i mean you could get you know what you could get like a cranberry juice or something like that and a vodka and call it a rose tito's because it would be kind of pink what do you think yeah <laughs> so said Ew, then it's perfect if it's gross it's perfect yeah i don't know Vodka cranberry, I know that's, that's, it's ordinary, but we could do that. It's not really what I want though. 
Not really what I want. By the way, uh, now the line is super long. I mean, there were only three people in line, and now there are like 25 people in line behind me. That's how dire the situation is here at Disney World. Order a blue Luke. Ew. I don't think so. I don't think I'll be ordering that. Yeah. I really wanted to see the um, the Stormtrooper and Darth Vader dance show, but that didn't happen. We missed that somehow, guys. I feel like I failed you. Well, I, mean, I don't. Actually, I don't know. I think there's an after hours. It, Disney goes from ten to midnight, and they do goofy stuff. Do I want to stay? How have I only been streaming for forty-five minutes when it feels like six hours? Cherry Coke and tequila. I don't know. Well, okay, some people are saying go home and rethink your life. I don't know. I might. I might have to do that. It really is nice out. Yeah, Star Wars drives a lot of people to drink. <laughs> now that would be cool if you could cut someone's arm off in line, like Star Wars. Get into a fight with someone, cut their arm off. Yeah. Line is long. These guys are already drinking. They've been drinking all day. Uh, I don't know. Do I just want a beer? It is. It's last call, guys. And it's it's my first drink, and it's last call. Got a super chat. Uh, Emery Calame, thank you for $5. Order the death sticks. Disney makes great death sticks. I don't know what death sticks are, but it, it, it doesn't sound great. It doesn't sound great. I won't have one for $5, that's for sure. You guys want to say hi to 745 Star Wars fans right now? All right, here we go. Here's the line behind me. What are you guys drinking? Tito's, okay, see, they we're having an argument about Tito's not being very good. I'm a great goose man. Tito's, okay, all right, all right. Very cool. Yeah, this is it. This is last call. This is the end, and Ron gets to go home. He's sick of it. He's sick of it. He's like, you know what? It doesn't feel like a small world after all when you're pouring drinks all day long at Disney World. There could be. There could be worse things. You could be live streaming about Star Wars all night long. I want a pair of those right there. Those are awesome. They're like Mickey Mouse ears, but like they show Star Wars things in them. Star Wars imagery. No, I don't want to do anymore. Sorry. I'm going to watch Star Wars. Ron is going home to watch Star Wars. Which movie are you going to watch, Ron? The first, like the very first one, right? Okay, you're going to just stream them all. It's only, what, 16, 20, 18 hours or something? That's not too long to spend with, uh... All the stops watching to come to work, but, you know. Yeah. I'll tell you, we walked around the whole park and all we saw were two stormtroopers. We did not see a lot of... And they were looking for you, too. I don't know how they missed you. Well, I said hello to them. They did not say hi back. They said, move along. Move okay. along, sir. So I need a um, seven and seven. That's what I've settled on. Double, right? Yeah, definitely double. Thank you for saying that. You're a gentleman. <laughs> What's a seven and seven double cost at Disney World? I better double my the money I put down. No, it's only seven dollars more. <laughs> okay. Twelve twenty-five. Really? That's not bad. That's not New York City. 
Mm. Show in New York. And when people are like, wow, the prices here are lower. Are you from Miami or New York? <laughs> and but it's Miami. Oh, okay. There is no waitress here. The, wait the waitress left. She was over there telling people that they couldn't sit down, so she's not here. These are just people in line. They're next in line. People are saying to say hello to you. Aww. <laughs> it's not me. It's them, dude. You know, it's... All right. Ask for a straw. I got, Look, it comes with two little straws. <laughs> Here, put that in your cup. Thank, Thank you. You, so you, you have a great night. May the force be with you Thanks. and you. you too. All right. Cheers. All right. Mm. Let's see. There are places to sit, but I don't know if we're going to keep walking or what. Yeah, this is uh, very strong. Chug it. You don't chug this. Not when it's the only drink you get. All right, where are we? Star Wars, everything for the film fan. Not everything, though. Not Rose Tico. We will go look. So far, the only thing we've purchased is a bottle of wine. And I can review it for you. I do plan on doing a review video of that bottle of wine. But, you know, what's it going to get? 10 views? Nobody's going to watch that. Nobody is going to watch that video. All right. Yep, they have Soylo shirts. Uh, these are actually men's shirts. I know they don't look like it, but this is a men's, uh, men's large right there. And nothing else. Hmm. Got some mugs. Nothing Rose Tico though. Very little Rose Tico merchandise. Let's look very carefully here. Some stormtroopers. These are nice. I don't know. Oh, they're. It's like for. A, it's a clip frame. Yeah. Oh my God. I love you. I know. That is, this is the couple's hat of the century. If me and Andrea were Ethan and Ela, we would wear these together. But we're not. We're Ethan and Andrea. Let me get out of people's way here. Thank you for $2 Midnight Cherry TV. Um, stay for fireworks and there's Vader cupcakes somewhere. That's a, that's a good suggestion. I actually have that shirt at home in my closet from the last time we went to Disney. Um, yeah, I'm trying not to film people that don't want to be filmed. Hey, honey, I got you some jewelry for our anniversary. Happy anniversary. Um, I don't see the hat that I, that I saw that woman wearing. Uh, I wish I did. Wow, that is... This is, this is disco. I would wear this. This is for women, but I would definitely wear it, ironically. I'd rock it. I would definitely rock that hat. Or this one here with the bling, the bling bling. The blingity bling. All right, let's get out of here. There's nothing. There's no Rose Tico. Some of you said you're going to be tripping over Rose Tico merchandise. You're not even going to know what to do. You all lied. There was no Rose Tico merchandise at all. None. All right, let's sit down at this bench here like an old man. I'm gonna sit on this bench like an old man and finish my drink. Ugh, and watch this guy. This guy's hard at work. Um, yeah, people watch. Uh, suggesting that I buy a lightsaber. It's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. Hmm. Yeah. Andrea, if you're watching right now, I love you. You don't have to comment. I know you watch quietly. That's fine. But I hope you're having a good time. Kenneth Byrne, thank you for 10, uh, 10 somethings, 10 euros. Uh, that drink's on me, Uncle Ethan. Love from Ireland. Cheers, Kenneth. Thank you very much. Cheers. Oops. I must put you in a timeout. Cancel. Am I still screaming? Yeah. Okay. Good. 
Yeah, I'm trying to do everything with one hand. I've got a drink in one hand. I'm walking around and uh, just trying to uh, just trying to look at super chats. I'm screwing myself over. Very very nice here. 804 people watching me watch people at Disney World. It's a little sad. It's a little sad. Where's the chat? Uh, Jesse N, thank you for two dollars. Even Disney knows Rose Tico sucks. Well hung and dung, thank you for two pounds. Wookie feet on sale. Uh, I haven't seen any. Uh, diversity, inclusion, compassion. That's Cecil right there. Thank you for two dollars. Where's your mobility scooter? Uh, Cecil, I do not need one yet. Thank you. Uh, Planet Musk vlog. Thank you for four ninety nine towards the drink. Pro Animator here. Thanks for jumping on the Soylo hand grenade for me. Wish I could see your reaction to it live. Uh, I, I did buy my movie ticket for that already. I'm going to go see it at 7 p.m. on the 24th, which I guess isn't the earliest viewing. I think it is showing on the 23rd, but I couldn't find any. Um, so uh, let's see. Uh, Lens Quest, thank you for $5. I purchased a commission drawing from you a few days ago. Hope the character choices were okay. Sure they are. I'm going to draw a bunch of stuff in my hotel room if I'm sober. Um, Jesse N, thank you for $2. You owe it to yourself to watch some good old porn. Jesse, you know by now, because I know that you're a regular viewer of this channel, that we do everything that we can to avoid um, the devil scourge pornography. Um, Emery Calame, thank you for $2. Get your Star Wars liquor at Disney World. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people seem to want to leave here. Uh, Jesse N, thank you for $5. There needs to be an exhibit where you can punch Ryan Johnson in the face, at least a foam replica of them. You, sir, need to be put in charge of this theme park. Uh, Emery Calame, thank you for $5. Freedom costs a buck oh five. That's a bargain at that price. Dragon, Dragoon 347, $2. See if you can find Mark Hamill's dignity to buy. Uh, I think I could buy it four times over with that $2. Jesse N, thank you for $2. Look for Michael Jackson's Secret Passage. Is there one? Uh, okay, I got through all the Super Chats this time. All of them. That's great. I did a good job all the live chat messages all right we're back yeah i had to turn off the chat for a minute but we're, we're back again it's very important that i acknowledge super chats it's only fair they released the dobermans in an hour i hope not what time is it i don't have my watch on for some reason i thought i would use my uh iphone some of you are worried about the battery life on my phone uh i hear you Fortunately, I have this Rose Tico phone battery, and we will plug that in right now. All right, and now we are good, I believe, for an infinite amount of time. Infinite. Yeah, we got we got kids playing with lightsabers over here. That's good. Um, Hollywood Tower Hotel. I think the Tower of Terror is over there. I've been on it once. It was really kind of twilight zoned out. It was nice. John Campbell, thanks for $10 towards that lightsaber over there. You seriously want me to buy a lightsaber? I'll do it if you guys, if you, if you gave me money for it, I'll buy a lightsaber. Let me finish my drink though. Almost done. All right, that's it. We'll help keep our city clean. Uh, let's see, we got what, 125 PHP, I don't know what that is, um, but thanks for, thanks for the tour, Uncle Ethan, my pleasure. That's what we do together. This is the Comic Artist Pro Secrets family, after all, I gotta buy a lightsaber now. Somebody just paid me to buy a lightsaber. How much is a lightsaber? $35. $35, alright, well I got $10 off a lightsaber. This is crazy. Let me see if I have any cash left from my expenditures. This is all Ava's diaper money, by the way. Here you go. What color lightsaber do I want, fellas? Shout out. What colors do we have? Red, blue, green? All right, so red, blue, or green? Get red. Red, red. All right, we want red. All right, they like your hat. Oh, I'm... Darth Vader or we want Kylo Ren? oh, give me a break. We want Darth Vader. We don't want Kylo Ren. Ew. 
All right, let's see. Make it happen, Cap'n. Perfect. All right, let's have that. Does it make noise? No. Okay, so we got another $10 towards the lightsaber. Hold on a second. From Klein Dropper, $10 or the ears. All right, all right. No, we're good. And we got $5 from Breakdance Express. Uncle E, how drunk will you be to watch Soylo? Haven't seen Last Jedi. I'm done. Thanks. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be completely sober. I've got to have... Uh, it's not fair to my audience to be intoxicated uh, as I watch Soylo because uh, I need to have a, a good, uh, you know, a good analysis of the movie. You guys do turn to me for sound analysis of the Star Wars franchise, and it's important that I, I offer that to you. Planet Must Vlog, four ninety nine. Thank you. Someone meme Kathleen Kennedy wearing Infinity Gauntlet, snapping and making the Star Wars fan base disappear. <laughs> Damn, kid. All right, hang on. Can we turn this on? I didn't even ask him how to turn this on. How do we do it? Is it on already? Yo, oh, there it is. You love it, right? Thank you for this lightsaber super chat. I do appreciate it. We'll give this to a kid. You can't expect me to carry this around. I'm, I'm, I'm almost 45 years old. Phantasmic. What the... Here's a kid right here. Will you take this? There you go. <laughs> Dad took it and gave it to him. Okay. Hollywood Tower Hotel. I don't know. I don't know if we're going to do that. I just don't know. It's getting late. Uh, yeah, I, wherever I'm going, it's it's getting darker and not lighter. Oh, this is the... F I'm actually going to the Tower of Terror. I don't want to do that. We've got searchlights in the sky. Yeah, somebody said a thank you would have been nice. <laughs> Uh, Richard Zavallis gave me $2 and said, $35, get the f*** out. Well, yeah, but you guys, it's your money. You know, if you give me money to buy something, I got to buy it. It's kind of the way it goes. Da -da, where are we going here? We got a giant guitar ahead of us. On live stream? <laughs> That can, all right, there you go. There's there's somebody who's happy to be on a live stream. What is going on? Disney's a completely different place uh, after dark. I don't know how to get out of here at all. Can we get through there? I don't want to go on the Aerosmith ride. This is an Aerosmith ride. Do we want to do it? Do we want to go on the Aerosmith ride? It's a 55 minute wait. No, we don't want to go on the Aerosmith ride. Can't stand it. By the way, how bad do you think they feel? Like, how, how, how much do you think they're nervous about their Dude Looks Like a Lady song in 2018? I think they're nervous about it. I think they're not playing that song live anymore. Uh, Iron Claw 3000, thank you for $2. Uh, just as dark as Star Wars' future. <laughs> just as dark as that comment. Yeah, I want to see a set list from Aerosmith 2018. They ain't playing Dude Look Like a Lady anymore, are they? Not in 2018, not in this politically correct environment. That's over for that. Right or wrong? Right, okay. All right, we got a lot of people just cutting in front of us. They don't realize that I'm an old man and I'll fall right down. They don't realize. All right, so basically we know that we don't want to go there. That's the Tower of Terror. We don't want to fucking go there. That's the Aerosmith ride. The only choice is to go this way. Ridiculous. I'm getting to know Disney like, like the back of my hand. You guys know the back of my hand pretty well too, don't you? Honestly. 
I'm not sure most of you know what I look like, but you do know, uh, you do know the back of my hands. Oh, we got fireworks going off. I gotta get out of here. I wanna go home and go to bed so bad. <laughs> They're like we know your thumbs. So somebody is saying that that wasn't um, that wasn't fireworks. That was gunshots. Um, I do believe that that's probably true. At this point, there's more gunshots. Yeah, people are falling down left and right. It's chaos here at Disney World, but we have to keep our cool. We have to keep our cool. Uh, somebody's asking if I'm in Florida now. I think I am in Florida now. This is live. If you were at Disney World right where I'm standing right now, you would be witnessing the, the scene exactly as you're witnessing it. It's the miraculous miracle of live streaming. Here's the guy that we bought the lightsaber from. We gave it to a kid. We gave it to a kid. All right. Just so he knows. I don't want him to think that, you know. If you guys saw me, like you'd be like, what do you what would you be doing with a lightsaber? What's the matter with you? What did they say? And I'd say there's a lot. There's a lot. You have time? Make yourself comp comfy, pie face. Let me tell you a story. Let me tell you what's wrong with Uncle Ethan. Do, 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 do. Yeah, why are these people running? Why do you think there's gunshots all around us? They're all running. Do not tell Fireworks viewing? Fireworks viewing to your right, park exit to your left. Oh, so we have two choices. Right or left? Which way do you think we're going to go? Fireworks are to the right? I'll, I'll go to the right. I love you guys. I'll do it for you. Thank you so much, guys. We're doing the fireworks show. Look at that. I'll get you a little closer and let's enjoy the Disney magic together. They're not screwing up Star Wars right now. They're doing something else. Look at that. I do love Disney though. I just hate their Star Wars. Look at Walt. There's Walt's projection. Mm -hmm. We love you too. I love you guys too. Yeah, the, Walt, Walt Disney's last words were, don't let the Jews get Disney. That is true. That is true. Sorry, Walt. Uh, John Campbell, thanks for $2. Get someone's opinion on Last Jedi. I've been doing that all night. What a great show. So they're projecting... Um, I can't tell, really. Oh, there's Beauty and the Beast dancing. You guys enjoying this? My children? No, it's gonna get better. They're gonna be fireworks. It's not that lame. It's pretty it's a pretty good spectacle. It's big. Whoa, that's me up there. That's me when I get out of bed every morning. There's Princess Leia. Yeah. 
Some people are saying this is terrible. They want explosions. There's a naked boy. This King Kong, I think. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, this better not be porn. Whoever said that, right on. A lot of people saying this sucks. A lot of people getting angry with me. People asking me to get them to play Song of the South. I can't do that. I can't get zippity doo dah. Sorry. People in front of me turning around looking at me. As the number of people in my chat decreases dramatically. Indiana Jones. People saying I should have gone on Aerosmith. You're wrong. I've been on it. People are saying get the people in front of you angry enough to yell at you. They're getting there. They're getting there. See that head? It's turning red. Yeah. Boom. All right, fireworks. Let's go. The whole thing went black. And then we got fireworks, right? No. I'm telling you, they're going to show Star Wars pretty soon, and it's going to be an outrage. People are telling me to lick the head and run. I'm not going to do that. I'm standing my ground, no matter what I do. No, no matter what I do, I'm standing my ground. You're welcome. I'm glad to take you guys to Disney. It's your Uncle Ethan. That's what uncles do. Uh, there are a lot of, you can't probably can't see them, but there are a lot of, uh, whatchamacallit, there are lights in the sky here, searchlights, in all different directions. I'm sure you can't see. Okay, forget it, sorry. A lot of people calling me thick boy, that's not nice. I'm not that thick. I mean, I'm dumb, but I'm not that fat. I'm, maybe I am fat, I don't know. Don't know. I can't see me. To the, the chat is now making fun of me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, oh, look, the trees are lit up for the Guardians of the Galaxy. Everything is just beautiful. Thank you for two dollars, Mon Moth Mon Ma Papa Boba Fett. Just want to say thanks. Last time I saw Disney, I was twelve. You're welcome. You're welcome. He felt that. He felt that. Yeah, it is cool. I am stopping it. Let's watch the 
Guys, watch the show or I'm taking you home. Tom Hanks is in everything. Yeah, you guys made me give my diaper money away for a lightsaber. I'm not doing any of that. Nice. I'm gonna buy all this merch. No, Andrea didn't let me have any cards, you're right. <laughs> I told her, I said, I'm gonna buy some Star Wars stuff. But I didn't end up buying any Star Wars stuff. Just a bottle of wine. This new Mary Poppins movie is going to suck. I don't know why they couldn't just use Julie Andrews. I'll reject it. Someone is suggesting that the fireworks that are going to go off have special brainwashing abilities. Let's find out if that's true because here they come. Let's go fireworks. Let's go. That was, there, there were no fireworks. There weren't any. Thank you for $2, Brian Young. Yell, Katie Kennedy sucks. Katie Kennedy sucks. Was that good? All right. I got to do what you guys say. There's no fireworks. That didn't happen. Everybody's turning around, though. I'll turn around, too. Julie Andrews was hot. There's no doubt about that. Nobody here is disagreeing with you. I'll tell you. Hot dogs? What's over there? Are you guys hungry? You want something to eat? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Excuse me, my friend. All right, here we go. They got pe No, no, wait, 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 wait. I'm like Indiana Jones. I'm so sorry. Could I get a BB-8? Oh my God, you have ad -ats. I know, right? Okay. You guys are live streaming now. Wait a second. Live streaming to 798 people right now. So you can say hi, Star Wars fans. Um, I want to, what is, what comes in the ad ad? A popcorn. I want a popcorn and I want a BB-8 with like Coca-Cola in it. I got to sober up a little bit. Look at that. Are you kidding me? That is nice, right? Cool. Uh, yeah, please. Did you see The Last Jedi? Do you want to talk on camera about it real quick? No? A lot of people have been scarred by The Last Jedi. They don't want to talk about it. I was a, I was a big fan. You were and no. you wasn't. Oh, you weren't, okay. Yeah, n neither were any of my su uh, subscribers that are watching right now. They hated it. They're good characters, but the story was just magic. Yeah. Oh, look. All right, can I get the largest Sprite? Oh, no, right? make that a lemonade. No, that's it. That's plenty. I don't know how I'm going to carry this. Got my BB-8. I don't, I don't know what I'm gonna, how am I gonna do this? I might have to sign off. Here you go. Thank you. Do I have to sign? No? Okay. I gotta make sure my credit card doesn't end up live streaming. All right, I don't know how I'm gonna do this, guys. I got too greedy. I didn't try to do You didn't? Oh, you're so nice. Oh, thank you. She accidentally didn't charge me and then she said, don't, don't worry about it. I won't worry about it. I won't. Let's go over here. She said, oh, there was a BB-8 as well? I, I didn't charge you. I 
know what to say. All right, let's go over here. We'll sit down. We'll enjoy our ad at. What's wrong? Hi there. Just Hi. Can't oh. Sit right there. Where can I sit? Oh, uh, just right past that tape line for me. They're very specific. Can you show me? Can you guide me over to where I can sit with your lightsaber? He's got a legit lightsaber. All right, I'm gonna sit right here. This gentleman looks like Paul McCartney. I'll sit next to him. I don't know about that. Okay, I'm gonna fix the leg. Yeah, what happened to it? Well, you know, ad ads are very prone to falling. Does it trip. bend? Well, yeah. Wouldn't be, wouldn't be good if it didn't bend. You know? That's Ooh. true. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I will. A lot of people looking at us right now, guys. A lot of people looking at us with suspicion in their eyes. We can't worry about that. We can't be self-conscious while we eat our ad at popcorn. The kids understand what's going on. They're like, you're live streaming to a bunch of people right now, aren't you? That's right. The adults don't understand that. That's the thing. That's the generation gap. This guy is trying to get people out of here. You can see him waving his lightsaber around like a lunatic. Some people are calling me uh, names. You don't need to call me names. Um, yeah, it is overly salty, actually. Luckily, we have a BB-8 filled with Coca-Cola that I got for free. These are the um, these are the privileges of being a world famous comic book artist. I love you too. Some of you, not all of you. Most of you I don't like, come to think of it. No, I love you all. Just kidding. What are you going to mean? Did you guys hear that? Okay, five minutes. Star Wars Galactic Spectacular. We are so there. Where? Do you know where it is? It's got to be here, right? I have a rule against filming kids, but there is a... She's probably 13. She's next. She knows exactly what's going on, and she is laughing. And this gentleman next to me does look a bit like Paul McCartney. Do people tell you that? No. No? You do. You look just like him. I'm still munching popcorn. We have five minutes before the Star Wars Spectacular happens. There are people in line. They saw that I got a free BB-8. They're all seeing if they can scam a free BB-8 too. They can't. They can't. It was just me. I'm the only one who did it. 819 people wasting their night watching me do this right now. Too many of you. I'm not, I'm not Jake Paul, guys. You might think I'm Jake Paul. I'm not. You, you, you found the wrong live stream. I'm not Logan Paul either. If I was, I'd be electrocuting a dead rat, and you don't see me doing that. Yeah. You call it bonding? Oh, I got a super chop. I can't see the super chop. Two dollars from Jesse N. Thank you so much. I'm at work waiting for 1 a.m. so my shift can end. I hear you, brother. I hear you. A lot of people are telling me disgusting things about themselves that I don't want to know. Custom song maker, thank you for five dollars. Search hashtag Ethan Van Skyver at Gab. I don't know why you would do that. Bye bye. <laughs> that little girl left. Brian, she was cracking up at the Jake Paul joke. Um, Brian Young, thank you for two dollars. Will you send me your free BB-8? No. Even though you just sent me two dollars and I got it for free, it's worth more than two dollars to me. Yeah. People walking by imitating Minnie Mouse. Adam A, thank you for two dollars. If you wish upon a star. I am. 
I'm wishing this weekend would end soon so I can go back home and be with my wife. <laughs> it's so weird being out alone. What goes on here? Um, Mike Howard says for $1.99, ask Paul McCartney if he liked The Last Jedi. Can I bother you for a second? Uh, okay, so we got 822 people watching right now. Will you go on camera or no? Yeah. Okay. Did you see Star Wars The Last Jedi? The last one that just came out. You didn't see it. So you still have a generally positive view of Star Wars? You, you have a still generally positive view of Star Wars because you didn't see that last film. Right. Okay. What did you think? Dude, he's British too. You are Paul McCartney. Maybe. No? No? Okay. All right, so he didn't see The Last Jedi. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, people are saying you do look like Paul McCartney. And then they're accusing you of being a spy. Are no. you a spy for, like, uh, what is it called? M M6? What is the British uh, uh, CIA? MI5. MI5. That's not you? No, just on holiday with a family. All right. They're quickly pointing out that Paul is dead and you couldn't be Paul McCartney. So. Paul McCartney is, is alive. Is he? Yeah. It's uh, Lennon and um, George Harrison who are dead. These people want to hold your hand. <laughs> Just FYI, you made a lot of fans. Thank you very much. Why are we bothering people, guys? All right. We're going to end this ad app popcorn. We're going to throw that away. This is a really nice ad app model, though. Wait, what's in here? Oh, you can wear it. Like, it's got, like, you can wear it like a purse. Look at that. Somebody said, go drunk, EVS, your home. I'm not drunk, and I'm... All right, uh, William Jenkins, thank you for $20. That's great. Half lane is an arrow in the knee. Amen. Hello from Britain. Five pounds from Voltaire's puppet. Thank you. We got to go find the Star Wars show, guys. We got to see that Star Wars show with our BB-8. I'll throw this away. <laughs> we're missing it we're missing it could you do me a favor could you throw that away please that popcorn thank you all right let's go all right we're not gonna miss it we're not gonna miss it oh we're right here perfect all right do I need to be inside? Can I get through you? Oh, thank you. All right. Had to get on the other side of a line. Whoa. I got BB-8. Harry Fisher. Ew. Gross. Ew. That's good. Fireworks going off. Ew. They put Holdo up there. Oh, that's badass. That is badass. Zoom out. Okay.
I can feel that. That's hot. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat, Ryan Young. Andrew is texting me. She's asking me if the ride was good. I can't stop my live stream. Thanks, Les Watch. I'm at Disney World. We're watching the Star Wars show live. Oh, no. Oh, nice. Cantina. are making fun of the last Jedi behind me. Perfect. Uh, 
<laughs> Yay! Thanks, Brian Young. Why is it going blurry? Oh, it is blurry. You're welcome. is that mask. particular order these scenes Zero Rose Tico so far. Zero. Four action figures, not one second of footage. Spectacular. Thank you, John Campbell. Thank you, Les Watch. Oh, 
Oh, they got a. Yeah. All right. Sorry. Thank you for joining us. Boys and girls, happy Star Wars Day from your Uncle Ethan and Comic Artist Pro Secrets. Thanks for joining me tonight. I love you all. Hey, hit the like on the way out. Subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed. I do love and appreciate you. Thanks for a lot of super chats. And um, I don't know, I'll probably see you tomorrow, okay? We'll do, we'll do it again. Not this, but we'll do something. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>